What we were describing today is a process called hydrothermal processing, and it converts wet waste materials into oil and gas, crude oil and natural gas, renewable fuels, completely renewable with what would otherwise have been waste. And it's the same process that makes fossil fuels, or that did make fossil fuels, where you have organic matter, leaves and algae and so forth, settles into a swamp and over millions of years it builds up temperature and pressure and makes oil and gas. We do the same thing, but we do it in an hour instead of millions of years. And you can use it the same way. You can send this bio crude oil, renewable crude oil, to a refinery, and make it into diesel or gasoline or jet fuel, and you can put the natural gas into a pipeline, just like fossil natural gas, and use it for electricity or transportation or, or home use. It's exactly the same kind of product, just doesn't burn fossil fuels. All the work that goes into this, and there, there have been uh, hundreds of millions of dollars spent uh, developing uh, processes like this. Our process has been developed at the Pacific Northwest National Laboratory, which is one of the Department of Energy's big national laboratories. And the funding has come from the California Energy Commission and Southern California Gas Company. So that's how this whole project was put together and, and brought along over a period of about four years until we were able to get this demonstration that we showed here today of the system actually working.